Hey guys, welcome back to Third Quest, yet again, part two. We did the Earth Labyrinth in the last episode. Struggled a bit here and there, just because I'm dumb. and didn't think to go back to certain areas. But now we have the Prisma Torch to light torches with. So let's see what we can do with our newly acquired item. We can light torches. That's a big deal, because we've come across a lot of torches that we can't light. Now we seem to get back up on... here we go, right here. Across... this way. We can't get that piece of heart on the stump or tree until, uh... We get some kind of hook shot. So we still have to wait on that. But we can light these torches, though. I've heard a little bit of... Tao Tao Mountain there from uh, Link's Awakening. Nice little cool bit there. So we can light that, and then hopefully have enough fuel to get us over here. Uh, is there another one? Uh, is there another torch? That was two torches. Huh. So is there not another one? That one's gonna go out now. Um... I don't see a third one. Did this lead to something... Okay, put us back in a rainwind jungle. With the bombable rocks. Okay. Oh, there's a Deku battle up there. Alright, so... What's the deal with these torches, then? Cause there's one. Ah! Uh, I am an idiot. I don't know why I did that. And of course, I probably can't get back up this way, right? No. Gotta go around again, I think. So yeah, third quest. We're still plugging along with this demo and see what else we can do. It's a 2018 demo. Eh, get away. I didn't see a third torch anywhere. Am I completely missing it or what? Or does that torch not do anything? possible that's the case. So what's the deal? There's no torch over there. Just a circle of rocks. Hmm. Yeah, I don't... Uh... Hmm. Alright, let's uh, not worry about that right now. What I want to look at is that there's... Torches here that lead to... that at, Are there at a gate? So you want to take the fire from in this room. Swoosh. Light this one up. I know we don't need to do that, but <laughs> force of habit. Let's see if we can open this gate. Hey. I wonder where this goes, if anywhere. Oh. Yo. Orozen Shore. Alright. Nice. It's a cool shot right here. I like it. You saw this in the uh, other demo, of course. But I wonder... Oh, the... Uh, in the other thing, there was like a sea shack right there, but that's not here in this. Okay. I'm seeing boulders, so I definitely feel like we're going to get bombs at some point. 
I'm not sure. Unless those are just there intentionally to... I don't know why I just did that, but whatever. Now we're down here. If we can poke in this little cave here, is there anything? Oh, it's Aura. Hello. Fancy meeting you down here. Hey, pal. I'm busy here, so be quiet if it ain't important. Da -da -da. Eh? You want to get inside that big red pa place over there? Yes. Trust me, I've been in there, and it's not great. If you really insist, though, I'll give you something helpful in exchange for some assistance. You see, my buds and I have been looking to get rid of some pests. They look like look a lot like big gold spiders. Ever seen them around? If you can prove you've gotten rid of, say, ten of them, I'll hand over something that may get you into where you're looking to be. Oh. So I wonder if we kill ten spooters, he'll give us like a hook shot or something like that. Hey, pal. Oh, I can't skip this at all? Oh, wow, okay. So you gotta sit through this whole dialogue if you accidentally talk to him again. Hmm. Okay. And it's not great. If you really insist on the... Uh, so we gotta slay 10 spooters. I don't know how many we've done so far. There's no way to check. There's no way to check. So we just have to guess, like, once we've gotten 10. Hmm. I don't know. I guess we're on a spooter hunt. I'll bet there's something up there on that, uh, that thing. Most likely. I'd be surprised if there wasn't. Oros and Shore. So we gotta keep a lookout for the spooters, then. And yes, I do want to get inside that red place. Because... It looks really cool. Ten spooters, huh? No problem for me. We definitely want to go up on that structure. We're full on rupees. Okay. Let's do it. Or maybe he'll give us bombs. I hear a spooter. Oh, that's another one down here. Aha. And again, just because I'm scared of the main menu, there's no indication. There's no status screen to show your uh, your spooters, which is kind of annoying. But it's okay. We'll just uh, we'll roll with it. Let's see what's up here. Hello. We've slain quite a few. I wonder if that's 10. Eh. <laughs> I don't know that was going to be fall damage. Hmm. Interesting. Alright, I guess let's um, try talking to him again now that we got two more. Because I know we got one side of the dungeon, and we got a couple like outside of the dungeon too. So that's got to account for something, right? Let's save state it and try and talk to him. And if he starts to give us the same dialogue again. Hey, pal. I'm busy here. <laughs> Why do it be important? And you want to get inside that big red place over there. Trust me. I've been in there. It's not great. You don't say, huh? If you really says, I'll give you something helpful in exchange for some assistance. You just make sure that nothing happens at the end of the dialogue. If you've gotten 10 spooters, hand over something that may get you into where you're looking to go. Right. Yeah, there's no... There is no status screen to see how many spooters we've gotten. Hmm. I guess we gotta check every nook and cranny. Make sure there's not one lurking around over here. Oh, there is! <laughs> so that's three more just in this area. One of the dungeon, which makes four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Did we slay six, like, outside of the dungeon before this? We might have. Let's save it again. Try talking to him. Now he still does the same thing. Alright. 
So let's go. I feel like we came across a spooter that we couldn't kill because we didn't have a sword yet. It was underneath a crate or something like that, I think. Let's check the side too, make sure there's no spooters lurking around on the outside of the building. Just to be sure. We checked the white structure already. And we can't get past these boulders or anything, so. I think we should go pursue elsewhere. Can't knock him out of the trees or anything. Yeah, I'll bet he gives us bombs. Either bombs or the hookshot. Something along those lines. Make sure there's not anything lurking around the outside of these trees or anything like that. That's fine, we can go on a spooter hunt. There's no more in the dungeon that we were in because boy did we peruse every inch of that place because we got stuck. It was kind of dumb because I up low, uh, raised the water level and it drained the water elsewhere. Let's go back in this little place if I can. Yeah, there's not uh, nothing else in here. Okay. I like that you can see the outside. So that leads to the Orzen whatever. Going this way. Dread Gulch. Gotcha. We're looking for spooters. Where can we find more spooters? It's my buddy Morton. Itty bitty lily pads. No spooters lurking around there. Cow. Sure's on hiding around. In the grass. Alright, this is back in the rain wind. Not sure if I missed any back in this area when I was looking for the sword. It's possible. Get. <laughs> Off he goes. Let's get high enough so that we can shimmy on over to the left. Not get knocked off. Uh oh. Too close for comfort there. Blocked. And we're back at Grim Coast. Oh, there's a uh, there's a chest up there. Huh. Looks like you can get through through an upper area. Huh. Well, that's the spooter I was thinking of is over here. Was over here. Probably was. Hmm. Was there a spooter in the ship somewhere? 
I thought I heard another one when I was getting close to the Skull Island place. So I wonder if I missed one in there. It's possible. I love this area. Ah, get away. Unless I got it or it was on the back of the skull. I think it was. And there's nothing to do with lighting more torches around this area. Stop that. <laughs> Stupid birds! Swine birds. Alright, maybe, uh. Hmm. What about getting on the ship this way? Ooh. I want that chest. I was kind of hoping I could, like, walk up the mast. Alright, so it doesn't look like there was anything more that I could do this side. Where I got the sword, which is fine. We're just on a spooter hunt. Can I walk up this a little bit? Yeah, yeah I want to get in that upper area. There's no way that I can walk this whole tree, right? Oh, I can. Almost. Huh. Supposed to be pretty high up. Alright, well, there doesn't seem to be any more spooters around this area, so let's move on. Elsewhere. Burp, 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 burp. Okay. No, you don't. Eh, I guess we'll just jump. Ah! Navigate the currents. Can't remember which way I went the last time. I know I wound up back at uh, the red. Structure. Oh, there's a waterfall. Ah. There's got to be more spooters around somewhere. I really wish I could see how many I have. <laughs> but, uh, it's obviously not possible. Swim away. Unless, is there something I'm missing on this menu or? World map. Save. Hm. Yeah, there's no way to see. There's no way to see. And this just goes back around that way. And I need a hookshot. So that's a no go. We need a way to blow up those rocks. Okay, back to Laguna Valley. Okay. We checked all that. I like the music. It's cool. I think, if I'm not mistaken, you swim under that. Yeah. Okay. It's gotta be more in like Dread Gulch or something like that. The only place I can think of there would be more. Well, I wonder, like, over here. Oh, there's this. I didn't go this way. I feel like this leads to a dead end, though. Yeah, looks like it. Well. Where's more spooters? Spooters. This is one over here. Could be. I haven't been this way. Aha! Hello there. Maybe that's 10. I'm betting that's probably 10. I just have to get back to the, 
back to the other area, which means we gotta swim for our lives. I really do like this so far. This is very custom. It really expands upon what we saw on the 2015. Uh, it really expands on what we saw on the 2015 demo, for sure. Alright, so we don't want to go that way. We want to go this way. Still don't understand those two torches that don't do anything. At least not right now. Hmm. Baguna Valley! I'm praying that this is 10, because I really don't know where else I would find more spooters. Please let this be 10. Please let this be 10. Alright, Zora. Cough it up. Haha, ah, looky there, 10 gone. <laughs> As promised, here's your reward. It should help clear some blockades. We got a bomb bag. Yes. Old leather. It has 20 bombs inside, so the dialogue's a little different there. Now you can set bombs to see and blow up stuff. How great. Aha. Now that's what I'm talking about. We got some boomers. So he gave us some boomers. Now we can get to more places. We've seen, bo we've seen rocks in like several places. So, I mean, the first immediate place is right here. So let's see what we can do with that. With our newly acquired boom booms. Newly acquired boom booms. Gnat. <laughs> gnat, gnat. Alright. Let's blow stuff up, man. Oops, didn't mean to pull out another one. Boom. Ah. Ah. Uh. Aha! What is this? Well. I bet I can't blow these up. Nope. Well, that was a false thing. Well, maybe he's talking about getting into that place using the bombs on the rocks that we see in uh, Rainwood. Rainwood. Probably. So let's go! Let me go right back to Dread Gulch. Do, 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 do. So, this way, I think. I know that both paths that we've gone to on Rainwood, yeah. Rainwind, that's right. Have had boulders. Alright. See a piece of heart up here, but we need a. Oh, hello. Yeah. Get out of here. All right, now we can get further into Rainwood. Rainwind, sorry. Uh-oh, uh-oh. No! Oh my gosh. I almost got knocked off. Okay. No Deku Nuts. Ah. Uh, is this the other way that we saw? No, this is another area entirely. Oh no, we did see this before. Dread Gulch, okay. So that was a Dread Gulch entrance that we saw that at. There's also rocks near the coast where we got the sword as well. Near that entrance. I do not like fighting Deku Babas with just the sword, but that was actually not too bad. Nothing in the water? Got a small chest. I wonder what this is. It's a giant tree in the background. Alright. Make our way around. 
free. Hello. So two jump attacks does a trick though. It's pretty sweet. Get out of here. More rocks. Boomskies. Ah, there's the coast entrance that I was talking about. Get. All right. Oh. Do you have anything worthwhile? Hmm. Aha. A red potion for 40 rupees. I mean, sure, but... Again, we don't have a way to use bottles. Item 0x55. Huh. That's interesting. Oh, wait. Is that the bottle or... No, it's not. Oh. Wait. How do we use it, though? Huh. So we have an item pouch. That's interesting, but again, I actually still doesn't seem like I can use it. Huh. Interesting concept, though, with the item pouch. All right, I guess we're gonna jump on this. Uh, oh, I guess we're jumping uh, over there. I think, yeah, it's the only place we can go. Let's save state it so we, in case we mess it up. Ah! Whew, okay. All right, what is this gonna be? Inside the Decker Tree. Hmm. Not what I was expecting. But, I mean, we can go for it and see what we get, because. I mean. I wonder what the slingshot would be. I really didn't think this would be the Deku tree, though. <laughs> interesting. Very interesting. We still have the new map for it, though. Look at this wall. The vines growing on a gif of rough surface. <laughs> Maybe you can climb it, soul. Dude, stop. Dude. Am I like soft locked in this dialogue? Why is it doing that? Oh my gosh, really? Will you shut up? All right, let's good thing I safe stated right before that. That was really weird. Does that mean I'm not gonna be able to climb those vines at all because I'm gonna be stuck with the dialogue? That was very strange. All right, let's skirt that area a little bit more because I don't want to get stuck like that again. Can we not? Thank you. Okay. <laughs> All right, that was really strange. Dungeon map, figure that much. All right, so this, if I'm not mistaken, is Master Quest. Ah, oh, stop it. Oh! Why are you doing that? Hmm. Glitchastic. Regroup. Get close to the wall, it does that. What the frick? Get out of here. Alright, so apparently you can access the debug controls. Okay. I haven't really messed around with these before, only ever once. So I wonder if I could just do this to get past that stupid spot. Okay. Let's see what else we find by, uh, Navigating through the Deku Tree. I'm not really sure, like, 
what the end of the demo is. Well, that's, that's at least lit now. We have our, uh, oh my gosh, really? By standing in front of it and pressing A. Don't tell me I'm going to get stuck with this dialogue again, too. Oh god, why? Alright, I don't think that, uh, there's going to really be a point to doing the Deku Tree at all here. So what happens if we leave the Deku Tree? Oh, we wind up back in Baguna Valley. Okay. That's kind of weird. So after doing some consulting, um, by accessing the debug menu by L, R, and Z with controller 2, okay, I'm told to go to map 112, I think, where are my notes here, uh, and navigate to room 119. One hundred and nineteen. Oh. Oh, wow. Okay. And that there is stuff in here. Ah, okay. Oh, we get to open all these chests. <laughs> yeah, I have some notes here. It's heart. Bottle. We gotta go through all this text. It's okay. Oh, scale. Okay. Interesting. Although my notes said to do it on a save file. So I wonder if, can I access that from while the game is running? Oops, that made the whole thing, uh, <laughs> that crashed the whole thing. All right, so uh, let's go into my save file and see if I can get in there that way. Oh wow, so nine, nine spooters. Ah, there it is. Okay, so I can do it within a save file. So let me go to map 119. Okay. I don't know why I have that text there, but uh, it is there. So let's grab all the stuff and then save it and go back into the game game. I'm not familiar with like any of this, like how this works with like the debug menu. Oh, that was another kind of shield. Gold scale. I can dive much deeper. Ba -da -ba. I get to open all these chests. <laughs> Hover boots. You can hover above the ground. The downside, no traction. You can even use these to walk for short periods where there is no solid ground. Be brave and trust in the boots. Mm -hmm. And really after like the hook shot and stuff like that. Gold gauntlets. Interesting how the sprites, like the item sprites on the thing are not what they actually are. We gotta go see the animation for each one. <laughs> Gold gauntlets, silver gauntlets. Power to lift big things with A. Uh, probably see them to Naburu. I don't think so. Uh, that could be a problem. Hey, where are you taking me? Wait, what? Really? That that triggered that scene? No! Well, actually, I kind of want to grab the chest behind me, too. You fiends, get it, Ors minions! We're suddenly back in Vanilla Ocarina. <laughs> get out of here now! These witches, they're using black magic on me! Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Let me get on with it. No. Yeah, there's nothing there. Oh, really? <laughs> What's up, Soul? Surprise to see me. Shut up, Owl. <laughs> Go away. <laughs> I don't want to talk to you. Butt mash. No. <laughs> I will continue to watch you. <laughs> Creeper. Creeper Owl. This is going to be a silver... Am I going to trigger this scene again? Please no. <laughs> you promised to give the delivery. You should keep your word. No! Oh! <laughs> Not again. Alright, uh, can we, uh... Okay. Heh <laughs> heh. Overridden. Okay, and this chest already open. So I didn't even need to sit through all that, but whatever. -da -da. So is that like the memory values changing? I know that like speedrunners or like glitch masters know how to manipulate the memories. I don't know what the RYs are. Someone who knows more about this stuff than me, uh, tell me what that is. Mirror shield. Press R to use it. Cool. Ah, uh, there's the hook. Oh, look at that sprite, though. That's cool. It's like a fish head. Fish shark shot. Shark shot. Hmm. That's pretty cool looking. I wish the actual item looked like that, though. That's the shield. Okay. Megaton hammer. We can break those rocks that we saw in the other area where we were blowing stuff up with the Zora. Iron boots. It's Loop City. That's the truth. Two text screens, of course. Outside of the well. We're not in the well. Ah, the fairy bell. Oh, wow. That's a cool uh, sprite for that. Proceed to take it out and hold it as you hold down C. So you can aim with the stick. Release C. Let fly with an arrow. Cool. Ah, oh, a blue boomerang. We saw the, the blue boomerang in uh, Indigo, didn't we? The magic boomerang? My hair's being stupid. There's the bomb bag, which you already had. Old leather. What could this be? The slingshot. Nifty. I want the other tunics actually too. Ah, stop it. It's unskippable text is killing me. All right, one more row. <laughs> Heart. All right, we got that one before. Two more. Whoa. Talk about glitched. I got the compass from the abyss. And a map. Okay. Quiver. 40 in total. 
All right, so what happens if we... All right, cool, so we can see the stuff here. The snake shot, a serpentine spring-loaded contraption that can pull you towards surfaces of hooks too, huh? Eagle bow, a soldier's bow of the past, symbolic of the mighty bird of prey. Arrows normal. Arrows normal? Item, item, bombs. Okay, that's pretty cool. What, uh, what's in here? Oh, does this not lead to anything? I don't know what this room is. Uh, maybe that wasn't such a good idea. Maybe... Oh, we already got that. Stop! How about this door? This lead to more? Oh. The Prisma Torch. Okay, we saw that. We already have that. Oh. A small key. Deck your nuts. Okay, so now we have those. Bombs. Oh, another whole room of this stuff. Oh, wow, nice. Any other floor items? Oh, there's more, more animations to go through. But we don't have a fast forward button. Ah. Pocket Cuckoo and got Kojiro in return. Okay. Oh, no animation for this one. Bomb shoes. Okay, that fills in that spot. The Ocarina of Time. It glows with a mystical light. No animation? A yeah, bloopy. Oh. <laughs> Animated. Look at every item in the game. I guess that's what the idea is. Ah. Oh, the Gora. Oh, look at that. This heat resistant tunic. Magic beans. Oh wow, look at that. They got a Zora tunic. The giant's knife. Where's the Goran sword though? The antique sword, okay. Ah. Although it's been lost at sea for a bit, it still looks great. Ah. Mm -mm. Zelda's letter. I know button mashing doesn't help, but... Oh, so magic beans are on the screen. So they have a use in uh, third quest? Or we're going to? Stone of Agony. Nearby. Secrets. Okay. Is that it? I think we got everything. Hmm. Looks like this is the end of it, though. Oh, another arc data. Nice. Ah, the adult's wallet. 200 rupees. The giant's wallet. 500. Oh, those are already open. That one's already open. Weird. Oh. Is that it? I think it might be. Alright, so let's... I'm assuming that saves it. We'll also save stated. Let's reset.
and see if we can load that file. Oh no, it crashed. All right, so let's go back in. Oh, now we're Young Link though. That's not good. Um, hmm. So how do we change the age? Oops. Option one. Oh, age 17. Okay, that's what I want. Okay. Um That's not where I want to be. <laughs> uh can we go back to like map 1 and it be the right spot? No. Oh god. <laughs> that is not what I wanted to see. Wait, so how do we get back to What is this? Uh, I don't know what I just got myself into. All right, we need our age to be 17, wherever we go back to. That's not what I want. Oh Lord. Our age is still five. How do we get back to, uh, all right, hold on. What if we save it? Reset it. It's saved that we're adult link. Then it's going to crash the game. Recent. If we go back in and load our file, will it load us back into that starting area? As adult link. <laughs> Darn it. <laughs> Please. Oh no. All right, so I have an idea. So 119. I can't see it. 119. Age 17. If we save in here. Saved. Reset the game, crash it. Recent ROMs. Go back in. Full screen. And then load back in. Oh, it puts us here. That's not where I want to be though. I want to be back in the other maps. No. I don't want the bottle. I want to be back where I'm supposed to be. Ah, why? Let me consult my notes here. Okay, I made it back to Grim Coast. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me save it. I have all the items. Reset. Crash the game. Can we load back in? Be where we want to be? Yes, thank you. Okay. <laughs> Well, that took some doing, but this is cool. Snake shot, eagle bow. Doesn't look any different on your hand, but that's okay. Is it long? Oh, it's short. It's not the long shot. Hmm. That's something we didn't get from the, uh, the loot room. Fascinating. Oh, I can't quite hook shot to that chest, can I? I hear you. All right, so now we have more stuff though. Tunic, aw. Oh. oh, it doesn't change when you uh, equip them. Oh, I was hoping that the, that the tunics would look different. All right, sword. 
Oh, wow. It's like a, a wooden sword. Great Deku sword. Didn't we see that in uh, the other demo? Shield. Ooh. Yo, that's cool. Oh, and the mirror shield, too. Huh. Wow, okay. That's cool. Boots. We have hover, iron. Huh. Oops. It's not regular. That's really cool, actually. But I can't hook shot to this chest because it's too far away. I guess I could debug my way. Uh, up and over. There we go. I wonder what this is. Oh, that's how you make that go away. Piece of heart. Cool. Well, I think that's where we're going to stop for now. I could probably get another episode of just messing around with the items and seeing what we can get to with them. So I think we're going to leave it there for now and maybe retouch on another episode. Just kind of messing around with a full inventory of stuff. So. Oh, wow. What the heck? Hmm. Cool. So if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you drop a comment and tell me what you think. Uh, subscribe for more stuff like this. I'm going to stay on top of third quest, uh, find out what's going on with that. And uh, yeah, subscribe for more, like, comment, and I will catch you in the next video. Until then, take care.